So you might be in a situation where for some reason your particular notifications are just not going away at all inside of your Android phone. Now, this can happen for a couple of different reasons. Number one, you might just want to double check what type of notifications you're having inside of your device. So if you swipe down, if your notifications are persistent, meaning you can't swipe them away, they might be very important notifications for you to go ahead and double check. So if those notifications come inside of this page, the best thing to kind of keep in mind here is to go through and just see if there's a way for you to go through and essentially clear out your particular notifications there. If there's not, you want to tap into that notification. So tap inside of that notification and that might allow you to also basically get some more information that way. And maybe you'll have to kind of you know, follow those settings on the prompt in order to swipe that notification out of the way. Now you might also want to go through and swipe down. There might be a clear all button at the bottom. You may have just gotten like a ton of that particular notification. So try swiping out of all those notifications that might end up fixing it there too. If that doesn't end up doing it, you might want to try going through and try restarting your phone. So hold down the buttons you normally would to restart your device and go ahead and restart your particular phone. Sometimes it can be as easy as just doing that and that might end up fixing the problem for you as well. And if that doesn't work, the next thing I'd recommend doing is to try updating your particular Android phone. So go inside of your particular Android settings. So come right into settings, go to Android settings right there. You wanna scroll down until you see this system option, which is right there. So tap on system. Then what you wanna do is you wanna click on software updates, which is right there. Click on software update again, and go ahead and try updating your system software here. So click download and install. Try downloading and installing an update, and that might end up fixing the problem for you as well. So those are pretty much the main ways to go and do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, not me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.